Hey guys, today I wanted to talk a little bit about TMD, temporomandibular joint dysfunction. I have noticed that almost everyone that have this type of dysfunction have an abnormal way of opening and closing the mouth, okay? And I believe that the reason for this is that the mandibular condyle is situated too far back in resting position, causing the pterygoid muscles to inhibit and thus uh, inhibiting the, the jaw from coming forward as they open the mouth. So. In this type of clients, usually the mandible, when they are opening the mouth, it will come down and backwards. And this is actually very detrimental because that will further exacerbate the, the shearing forces within the TMJ fossa. Okay. So how do, we, how do we investigate this? Well, just have your client open the mouth and you're looking for a, a, a lack of protrusion, okay? Protraction. So as they open the mouth, it will come down and back like this. Okay. In uh, clients who have had this issue for a long time, you can actually see that the um, mandibular condyle is popping out a little of the fossa. So they will often have this great bump and uh, and a lot of excessive loose skin around the TMJ area. So how do we correct this? Well, we have to teach them how to protract the jaw as they open the mouth, how it should be opened by using the pterygoids, especially the lateral pterygoid. So you have them, you teach them to protract the mandible as they open the mouth like this. That is how the mouth should be opened. So if you teach your client this and you will ask him, did that feel normal to you? And they will say, no, that felt really awkward. And there, there you have it, right? They are all the time opening their mouth with retraction, uh, causing uh, excessive shearing forces within the TMJ. And of course, eventually it will cause pain and other issues such as trigeminal uh, neuralgia and, and the things we do not want, obviously headaches and so on. So it's very important to teach the client to open the mouth properly. I also teach the client to gently protract uh, the mandible in posture so that the, these habitual shearing forces, even when the mouth is closed, uh, is ceased. So I hope this has been uh, informative. I think it's a very important topic. A lot of people are struggling with TMD and it's not really that difficult to fix, okay? The shearing forces are the cause of this problem. We get the mandible forward, we stop the habitual shearing forces as the mouth is open and closed, the problem goes away, okay? Have a nice day.